King Charles is facing fresh issues from Meghan Markle and Prince Harry just two months after Harry's grandmother, Queen Elizabeth II's death. Harry and Meghan released a documentary on Netflix and split the public down in the middle. The King, King Charles III, has been warned that he will take even more fire from Meghan and Harry in the future. He already knows that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will are not ready to stop anytime soon. Now, with the release of Spare, Prince Harry's new book, which is set to hit the market on the 10th of this month, and the release of the Netflix documentary, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are set to reveal more about King Charles and the royal family in his book, aside from all they have revealed in the docuseries that was released in December. When will these two stop? Because anything you do to them is going to make headline at the end of the day. So how can you even make them stop? King Charles has been taking an increasing amount of grief from Prince Harry and Meghan Markle and may face even more in the future. And that future is just a couple of days from now because spare is on the way. Last year, while most families settled down for Christmas, King Charles had to sit back and endure the Californian barrage coming his way. King Charles did not really enjoy the last Christmas because of what his son, Prince Harry, and his daughter-in-law, Meghan Markle, is doing. I'm sure Meghan Markle and Prince Harry did not really enjoy their Christmas. They didn't also enjoy it to the fullest because of what they have done. Except they are wicked people, then they can just move on. Because from all we've seen, there have been no love for family as they should. Their rebellion have driven them far from their families, both Meghan Markle's family and Prince Harry's family, so they just... They're just by themselves. A royal expert, Daniela Elsa, has warned the king to expect more from both Harry and Meghan in the future. And there's also the fact that the Sussex's money-making venture have largely hinged thus far. It is not going to end anytime soon because this is where their money comes from. That is their only source of income. King Charles has finally issued a strong warning to his son, Prince Harry, and daughter-in-law, Meghan Markle, by throwing his brother, Prince Andrew, out of Buckingham Palace, and according to reports, Prince Andrew will no longer be allowed an office in the building or to use it as a corresponding address. Uh, this, this is heavy. Now, this is a problem. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry do not care about anyone except themselves which is a problem. So punishing his brother for his mistakes might not even move him to repentance. His heart has already been hardened by his wife and also the money that comes. Hence, he might not even care that his brother was thrown out of the palace. Or at best, he would just bring the brother in and add him to his documentary and give him an episode to also explain how badly he was being treated by the royal family. King Charles' patience and tolerance are wearing thin by the day. And Andrew's punishment signal a precedence of potential future ban on Harry. King Charles' actions sparked a lot of reactions. One of the people that reacted said, It looks like the new king doesn't play. Goodbye, Andrew. Harry, you're next. According to what we have gathered, Meghan Markle is also preparing for her own memoir. After Harry's spare, she is planning on leaving no stone unturned as she contemplates writing her tell all. This is really funny. What does what does that one want to write? What does, what what does Meghan Markle know that she wants to write? Like you, you literally just joined the family, or has Harry vomited everything to you already? When did she join the palace where she's acting as though she was born there? She would not be leaving any stone unturned, like she said. So we wait. We await the lies because she has not spent all the ten years in that house to have such information to coming up with a book. So if she has not spent all the ten years in that house and she claims she has known all about the royal family to do a tell all me more, then we wait for the lies that she will spill. Except, of course, uh, Prince Harry may have sold his family out, uh, not just to Netflix and Spotify, but also to Meghan Markle. So while he is making money from Netflix and Spotify and trading his family as a commodity, he may have actually sold every other information to Meghan Markle, and now Meghan Markle probably have something she could blackmail the real family with. But then, it's just me thinking out loud. It's just my opinion. What do you think? Do you think Meghan Markle have enough information to write a book on the royal family? Like, do you think the few years that she has spent with the royal family, she have enough information that she could come up with a book? Let me know in the comments. And please don't forget to share this video.